How to save MATLAB figures in different formats? MATLAB is popular in students and researchers for generating the results both numerically and graphically. But one question arises in many minds that how to save MATLAB figures in different format to use in different text editor like MS Word, LaTeX to write thesis, report or a research article. The answer is very simple. Use the MATLAB built-in command save as. Save as is a command with three argument. The first argument is FIG, the figure and then uh, in the second argument we have the file name and in the third argument we have the format type. The default format of MATLAB figure is .fig. MATLAB provides a variety of formats to save your figures. Here are the list for the formats available in MATLAB and few of them are .fig, .m, .png, .jpg, .bmp, .pdf or .eps and so on and so forth. For more details you can visit the link in the description and let's do it practically okay now let's start with coding in matlab so first of all i will create an array for x to store some values like minus pi by 2 to with a gap of pi by 100 up to pi by 2 uh, why I why did I choose pi by 2 because I am uh, going to plot a sine function or a trigonometric function so y equals to sine of x this is just an example you can plot any function even in uh, two dimensional or three dimensional so uh, let's plot this function by using the plot command and I will decorate it by using r dash dash uh, it is red color with the dashed line and uh, let's say uh, I'll give a title to this or uh, I say it's a, a sign of X function uh, and let's create let's do some label thing that is X label and I say it's uh, it's X and uh, it the Y label is okay it is y so for instance i'll change the title uh, by graph of graph of trigonometry function okay so after doing this i will create a legend and okay this is sine of x now i will press uh, f5 to run this code and uh, have the result so here's a graph of uh, sine x and uh, everything look good uh, except with the y label i will change it and uh, will proceed to the uh, saving this file or this graph in different format one of the way is to save this manually by going into the file menu and clicking on the save as button I will choose the different format available to save the plot or the figure file. Uh, these, are, these are some formats available but this is the manual procedure and it takes a lot much time to save uh, this figure one by one in different format. So let's choose. Uh, an automatic or uh, uh, say uh, I will write a code uh, by using a save as command as we discussed earlier and I will write uh, here sign of X to change the Y label now I'm going to create an array of string and for this I will choose a, a letter F a variable in which I'm going to store the different elements of the string and for this I will use the square braces and in which each element is separated by commas uh, in the double quotes so first is jpg this is the format other is uh, like p and g this is the second format I will I will write bmp and let's say I will write tif 
and for uh, SVG I will write SVG. Now these are all the formats in which I am going to save all my files. So first of all I will write the command save as save as and then I will write GCF and for the file name I will choose it's like sign x or say plot this is my file name and this needs to be in the single quotes and then I will access each element one by one. So for instance, I will access the only element of F that is the first element F of one and I will run the code. So uh, when F of one, it means it will uh, pick up the file format as JPG. So I will hit the F5 button uh, to generate the results. So now you can see in my current folder, I have a sign x underscore plot dot jpg file. So uh, I will uh, do the other steps by uh, saving all the uh, files with the different formats, access all the elements or all the strings saved in f. Uh, we can uh, create a loop, a for loop before the save as command. And for this, I will write for i equals to 1 up to the numeral. Numeral is the command that is used to calculate the number of elements in an array. So it is numeral of f and uh, I will change the uh, change 1 with i to create the loop functional and I will do, write the end command to close the loop and now I hit the F5 button. Uh, after the graph is visible to the screen, uh, we have different files uh, with different file formats and you will see uh, in the current folder. So that's it. Uh, now you can see that I have .bmp file, .jpg file, .png, .svg and .tif. Everything runs so fine. Uh, so uh, in journal, we can use these file in a different text editor. For example, we use .eps that is encapsulated postscript files uh, generally in LaTeX and uh, we will use uh, the higher resolution PNG files in uh, uh, MS Word. So uh, here's an example. You can save uh, different files according to the requirement. You can easily save different files uh, just using save as command. Thank you so very much. This is uh, all for today.